Hello, hello! Welcome back to Let's Play Planet Coaster. Um, quick recap from the uh, from the first four episodes because it has been a couple of days. Um, we finished off the pirate village. Uh, we started off in the first episode building the pirate ship um, and the little entrance section. We then went on to build the uh, swamp river ride with the uh, with the crocodiles in. Uh, in the third episode, we moved on and built our first coaster, uh, which sits here, which is called uh, Shipmates Escape. And then in the fourth episode, we built uh, we built the shops, uh, built some food restaurants, toilets, etc., and a small little flat ride just to finish off the section. What I have done uh, just before recording this, I've put a few uh, put a bit of hilly, you know, a bit of hillage. I put a few hills in um, just to sort of block off this section now, only temporarily. Um, so if you're down at guest level, you can't see over. You, know, you can't see over these hills. What I want to do now is start building on the second section. Now, the second section I'm going to go for is a Western theme. Now, with the with the Western theme, um, a lot of the uh, a lot of the stuff from the pirates pirate section, you know, could cross over in the sense of the path is you know is wooden planks. Um, etc. That sort of style, the, a lot, you know, there's a lot of wood in the pirate area, there's going to be a lot of wood in the western theme, but there's also going to be a few other elements to make it different. Um, my plan is to have the pirate village to the left, western down the middle, and then once that's done, go off to the right and have another section, and then we finish with a bit of an entrance here. And that that is the general outline. How much we stick to that, I do not know. This is all, obviously, you know, depending on how it goes but that's uh, that is my general outline so what I need to do first is I need to build um, build a path going into the western section so let's, uh, let's just build that down there don't want this bit quite as long so m the aim for this episode is to have um, is to have a bit of an entrance sorted for the western uh western area and then also have uh have you know have a, have a ride in there as well so we may have a bit of scenery a uh, bit of a ride uh and then that will be that will be this episode before moving on to a a large main attraction within the western area uh what i'm going to do just here i'm going to make a sort of courtyard style um entrance um and I'm going to put a western building in the middle here uh, with the with the western building again just like on um, just like on the pirate section there is a lot of western decorations um, first of all though we are going to build the shell of this building um, you know in in western in western themed areas in parks etc you do get uh, you do get sort of sheriffs, officers, and um, and bars, etc. Um, now, my idea on this one, it's not going to be, it's not going to be aesthetically pleasing from all angles. This is going to be a big main sort of welcome to the western area building, so it is going to face the front entrance. So just here, um, this is going to. I uh, just need to uh, change that slightly. Let's just drop that down. Uh, in fact, let's just move that over a little bit more as well. Just so it's right on the edge. And drop that down. Because the path isn't quite... Um, isn't quite the perfect size, unfortunately. Let's just line that back up. Right. Back to, uh, back to four metres. So, uh, yeah, sorry. The... So the the west the western area is going to have a big sort of entrance facing this way. It's not going to be aesthetically pleasing from from all angles. Um, you know, it is just a big showcase sort of, you know, what welcome to the area, and getting people in the mood really. Um, nothing too fancy with the with the show. Um, just a bit, it basically just a bit of um, a bit of a balcony going on. A uh, bit of some, you know, decorations on the external of the building, and 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 that's that's about it really. Um, there'll be a lot of 
a lot of props um, for this building. That's that's where the west that's where the western theme comes in well in Planet Coaster, is the um, is the props that are available um, at our disposal. Um, but like I say, that I think more more so than the pirate area. I think the western area does offer a lot more in Planet Coaster. Um, although there is still a good selection of um, of pirate um, pirate decor. Now what I am going to do is I'm going to build, um, I'm going to put some shops in here at the front. Um, so I'm just going to take out some of these panels just so um, we can fit some shops along here just like that. Uh, and then we'll go into, I'm just put some shop fronts in. Um, just line these up. One. Oh, that's not quite on, is it? Two. Three. Just make sure that one. It. Yep, that one's in. So there's our, there's our three shop entrances. Um, before we move on, let's uh, let's just put the shops in because otherwise, if we start boxing everywhere in, let's have a, a soda stall. We want it facing that way. Bring it down there. Cool pee. Some weird noises when you play stuff in uh, in this game for sure. Uh, what else have we got? Uh, we, we already had. We, I think we had pizza in the uh, in the pirate place, so we'll, we'll leave the pizza. Monsieur Fritz. It's uh, certainly certainly French. Don't know about Western, but it it fits. It it does its it does its job. Uh, what else have we got here? Let's see. Coffee. Everybody loves coffee. Except me. Fun fact, don't drink coffee. Um, so there in there we can uh, we we'll put a we'll put a toilet section on the back uh, just so that just so that there is another toilet building there. And I don't start getting complaints to say, oh there's no toilets available. Um, we don't want it poking out of the building. There we go. That's what we want. Want it like that. Uh, just while I'm here, I am going to close the uh, close the shops because we know that the uh, staff working there get rather annoyed when they uh, when they get bored. So we'll just close them all, and they can go for a wander. See you in a bit, guys. There they go. Look, he's happy. Look, he's been told he can finish. Um. So that that's that's the shell of our building. Let's uh, let's go and put a roof on it. So as I say, the idea behind this is that there's not going to be there's not going to be anything too fancy going along here. Uh, do I, I want to edit that building first? Don't I? Edit building. Create. Right. Uh, what do? I, is this castle roof look alright up here? I think that I think that could do like that. So let's just stick that all the way. Up. Maybe not like that. <laughs> uh, stick that down there. And like that. And then we'll stick it on four meters. Just like that. And let's just stick the uh, let's just stick the roof on here, and then once we've done this, this will be the shell of the building, and it will be time for decoration. Um, as I say, I'm not venturing too far into buildings in this park. Um, I want to sort of get to grips with putting a whole park together. Now you can't do that without scenery. Um, but I don't want the scenery to be the be all and end all. I, I do. I would like to get better at the scenery, and uh, and build a uh, build a park in the future um, where the scenery stands out. Um, but for now, what I'm aiming for is um, just I, I'm not going to say bog standard <laughs> scenery, but what I will say is you know nothing nothing too fancy is uh, is the style I'm going for. Uh, so what we'll do is we'll put a uh, we'll put a balcony um, 
up here. Let's have let's have the surface thing on. So put the balconies on. Like so. Let's line these up, they weren't lined up. But uh, yeah, so I mean what what I'll probably do is I'll um I'll just time lapse the uh, the, the scenery elements uh, just because as you can see they, uh, they they do take some time placing down uh, and you can see what this building looks like before we uh, hop back and carry on building a new attraction in the area um, as I say I want my aim for this episode is to do is to do this building and to also build a build the first attraction in here so um, yeah I shall uh, I shall see you shortly.
welcome back. Um, as you uh, as you probably saw, I've been uh, been uh, pretty busy putting in the uh, putting in the scenery for this entrance. Um, I wanted to have some sort of grand entrance. I say grand, you know, it's just a sizable, let's say, entrance. A bit like this pirate village sign for that area. Um, I went for this western sort of archway, um, but then just to add to it, because it does look rather small in comparison, um, I went for these uh, sort of wind uh, wind turbines, you call them? Wind, wind something, aren't they? Um, whatever they are. So I, w I went for that to make it sort of a grand entrance. So as you walk through here, you know, you met with, uh, with a campfire and a sort of chilling cowboy on one side another chilling cowboy on the other side with some boxes um, a bit of an oil uh, oil digger um, got a, an abandoned train here um, and another carriage on the other side and then you've got the, the main building decorated obviously you know you saw the show before and we've got the uh, we've got the luggage we've got a load of wanted posters because wanted posters are always everywhere and it's always the same face all the time um i've just called it yield in um just as decoration it isn't actually uh, you know a functional building you can't they can't go in it they can just use the shops that's all um and yeah i've just got all these uh, red white and blue banners going around as you can see more wanted posters and then the toilets sat around the back um so that that I'm, I'm I'm happy with that as the entrance. Uh, like I say, as you go in, you know, as you go into this this area, the pirate area, you you can go right and you can get get to the pirate building or have a look and you got the rides. Um, in here, you go straight in, you f come up facing the building, and then you walk around the back and then it opens up. Now, what I'm hoping for is to put a ride in this hit this area for for now for this episode. We'll put in a flat ride around here. Um, and then once we've done that following on we'll then sort of develop it and go out a little bit and finish off this section on this path I'm going down here probably about that size before building the third section of the park so uh, yeah we'll, we'll go for we'll go for a flat ride here um, genuinely not had any look at any of the rides at the minute to see what what I think is going to be most suitable um, Obviously, we want to we want to have something that fits the Western, you know, the the, the Western theme, um, but also something that, uh, that people are going to enjoy. Um, I do, I do like the look of some of these rides. Um, I, do, I do like a good chair swing. In fairness, I think chair swings are very underrated flat rides. Um, so I think we'll put a chair swing just here. And I think that'll work well because when when the chairs are in the air, you better to see over that hill slightly, so you get sort of like a glimpse into. I, I know you can see the top of that building and the wild coaster in the distance, but you can get a full-on look over um, at that point. So if we put that on there, um, we probably want probably want the entrance coming off. Uh, let's, yeah, let's get the entrance coming off this way, and then the exit can push people a bit further out, basically if they've been on the ride. So we'll have the exit coming off um, a bit further out that way. Um, we want to go to the horizontal, no, sorry, the vertical ones because we used horizontal for the pirate area. We don't want it that wide. We only want a thin, um, a thin-looking uh, queue path for for this flat ride. So uh, we'll have it sort of twisting around here. I think it's it, this is just free freehand built. There's no uh, no snapping, no no plan. Just going going where I think it suits really. Um, I think it'd be nice to have it sort of tucking off to the side, down the side here, so that people aren't blocking the entrance if they want to get down to that ride. I'll put that in there. That's a it's a nice little basic basic entrance. And then the exit um, we want to have vertical vertical panels again small as we can and then we want them we want the exit sort of just going down just going down there like that um, and then we can all, we can either build off the exit if we want or we can uh, we can leave it like that it gives us a bit of bit of like open uh, open plan basically to go with um, let's just test that now as as we saw on the other rides there is this uh, there is the scenery counter and my aim is to have all rides at 100 percent on on the scenery um on the scenery counter and we're only at 17 percent at the minute 
Now, that'll be because it's hills. There's a cacti there. Cacti or cactus, however you want to call it. Please don't correct me, my grammar in the uh, in the comments, because uh, I'm not I'm not good with grammar. Um, and obviously, this station the, that building is nearby. So, what we need to do is just add a little bit more scenery. So I think if we carry on putting a few uh, a few cacti, cactus, cactuses, whatever the plural of cactus is, um, if we just put a few more of these down here. Um, probably can't, yeah. Probably can't pump too close because the chair swing might um, might go into them, and uh, that could end up with a nasty little accident um, if someone hits a cactus while they're on that ride. So we'll, we'll just sort of surround it with with these because I'll be honest, I don't I don't think there's many other trees other than other than cacti that um, suit the western area, is there? I can't think of many. Um, I can't think of many western themed western themed trees other than other than that. See it's up at twenty six percent now. So what we want to do, we wanna add some props really, don't we? Um we wanna add let's just get that um let's just get that western theme back up. And let's add we wanna add some sort of, you know, some like dynamite boxes and where people are going to be, oh look, there's, you know, look at that there. That that looks cool. That you know, that that's the sort of uh, that's the sort of thing we're looking for. Um, we don't want a piston line on the floor, do we? Uh, maybe maybe some wheels. You have some sometimes have some like abandoned wheels, don't you? Just sort of laying around. Um, or one just spinning on its own. See, uh, see if they like that. Uh, what else have we got down here? Bit of metal. Let's just put some bars on here. Uh, ideally, we want that to uh, we want it to line up really, don't we? Like that. So let's just uh, yeah, like I say, it's just it's just a case of sticking in, sticking in different items, seeing seeing what works, what doesn't, and um, yeah, we'll just. Uh, We'll just see how, how some of this stuff gets on. Uh, I think this oil pump's gonna, yeah, it's going to be far too big to uh, to fit in <laughs> fit in along the queue line. I think um, some rope stool there, where they would obviously tie rope around. Uh, there's rope a rope stool empty, and then there's one with with rope on. So we'll we'll have, we'll have both. We'll stick we'll stick some both down. We've got some spare spare lots of rope there. Why not? Why not? A milk churn. Some milk in there. There's no. I'm not going for any general. You know, there's no. I've got no general idea in my head as to what I want. Just you know, just something that that fits in with the with the area. Really, there's. I think we are reaching the sort of limits as to what we can put on this queue line. Really, uh, put a few more of these boxes down. And I know we've got some wooden crates that we uh, that we used at the entrance which are these some small ones there uh, let's just get the big ones in uh, let's get the big ones sat down the side there obviously we're building on a building on the side of a hill here so um, we are a little bit limited for space but I like it I like I like the fact it's compact I don't like leaving massive open areas um, I know I've just hidden that little one there but that's all right we'll Put, uh, put a little one back on top there. Yeah, I don't like leaving massive open areas in these sorts of parks. I like, I'll, I'd rather cram everything into a small area rather than spread everything out. So using the whole area of the map, I'd rather have a smaller park and make it look better. Because I think just plain areas look a bit, just look a bit boring, really. Um, so yeah, I think. Um, can't be far off, really. I don't think there's that much else we can um, we can really go at. Um, so let's just see uh, what we at. Forty-eight percent. Might have to decorate these. Uh, might have to decorate these hills, or might have just have to. Because I think if we overdo it, I think if we overdo it, it will look tacky. 
and I'd rather it look better than be just absolutely covered. So I think we may have to settle for 48% there, just so it's not just it's not rammed with with decoration. I mean, you know, as you come down here, you got boxes, you've got dynamite, you've got these rope stools, you've got these wheels, cacti. You've got plenty of stuff going on. Um, so I think there's I think there's plenty there to to look at and go on. So um, yeah, I think I think for a start for the uh, for the western theme. I think that's uh, I think that's looking spot on really so far. Like I say, nothing nothing crazy, no, no crazy amounts of detail in here, um, but 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 it's enough. It it, do, it does the job, and that's 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 what I'm aiming for in this in this series. This is the first series. I am trying to still get used to it um, and uh, learn more about it. See what options there are on the scenery. Um, see what options there are on the rides etc so uh, yeah I think we'll leave episode 5 there for now that's the uh, that's the start of the western area um, episode 6 we will uh, we'll start on one of the big attractions I've got an idea for one maybe two big attractions in the western area um, so yeah please uh, please like if you uh, if you have enjoyed this uh, and subscribe if you do want to see more do you want to stick around for uh, episode 5 um, and I shall see you next time. Thank you. Bye-bye.